Hey there, it's Imran and you're watching Imran Plus. Welcome back, it's Super Bowl Sunday, which means lots and lots of trailers. We also have Rihanna's halftime show. She's performing live for the first time after five years. I'm personally excited for that. We have a great game set up. And of course, we have some great trailers. Disappointed that The Little Mermaid is not debuting its trailer at the Super Bowl. I was really looking forward to that. So we're gonna have to wait some more time to see The Little Mermaid trailer, but we have The Flash dropping its official trailer today. I'm so excited to check this out. There's a lot of drama surrounding this movie and its lead actor, Ezra Miller. Lots and lots of behind the scenes drama with Ezra. There's gonna be a lot of explaining that's gonna happen. Um, and I feel like that's gonna weigh heavily on this movie. It's crazy to think about when this movie was first announced, was the same year that The Flash on CW was first announced or like came out. And now The Flash is wrapping up its entire series with its ninth season on the CW and we still haven't gotten a trailer for the Flash movie until right now. Isn't that crazy? That's crazy. But I'm a huge fan of the Flash as a character. I really enjoy the CW show. I used to watch it all the time with my brothers. Um, I stopped around season four, but you know, I have a lot of respect for that show. It accomplished a lot of things and I think it set a lot of standards. So looking forward to this trailer, a lot of people, including James Gunn, are saying that this is one of the best comic book movies ever made, which to me is a bold statement. So I'm going to have to see for myself to believe it. So before we check out this trailer, if you haven't already, make sure you click that subscribe button so you can help this channel grow and so you don't miss any upcoming videos, which are, there's going to be a lot of since we have a lot of trailers coming out. But for now, let's check out the official trailer for The Flash. Tell me something. Oh man, I'm so excited. Anywhere. I still hate the suit. Another Sorry. Timeline. Another universe. Oh wow, Batman was involved. <gasps> so why do you want Look to how... fight to save this one? Oh wow, wow, wow. Supergirl. Because this is the world where my mom lives. I'm not gonna lose her again. Oh wow. Oh wow. Look at the lightning. Oh wow. Different people, different worlds. Drawn to each other like magnets. My face. So my face. Okay. If you were to go into the past. You have no idea what the consequences can be. Whoa. Bruce, <gasps> the ring. You can also destroy mm, everything. Bruce. Zod. I completely broke the universe. Oh. Zod, we've been waiting for you. I created a world. That's no so awesome. Humans. And now there's no one to defend us. Oh, is that Superman from Flashpoint? Want some help? Wow. <laughs> you are. Yeah. I'm Batman. Nice. Oh, look at that. Wow, he moves well. Is that? If I can't undo what I did. Oh my God, so much is happening. If I can't get back, it looks cool. There Two flashes. A future. Yeah, this is from Flashpoint. Uh, super girl scenes. Yes. Oh, did you see that? Oh my God. Batman, what do we do? We try not to die. It's not Clark. Oh wow. My name is Kara. I, I'm Barry. Well, we're Barry. Wow. Look at that. Barry, what are you doing? Our kids are going to want to see this. Oh, wow. <laughs> and of course, the comics were all started. Flashpoint. Whoa, so much happened in that trailer. Man, man, man. 
Wow, okay. Um, <laughs> wow, where to even begin? Okay, I think that looks like it has a lot of potential. That looks like it has a lot of potential. Um, I, I'm a sucker for DC Comics, so of course I'm hyped and I'm excited for it. And I like The Flash. I think The Flashpoint story is so awesome. Um, I don't think they'll ever be able to capture the awesomeness of the comic run and like the animated series even because they just don't have that many like cameos and they, like you know there's the war between Aquaman like the Atlanteans and the Amazons we have so many changed characters like the Shazam family and then we have reverse flash involved like there's so many more elements to it maybe they're saving that and hiding it from the trailers but wow wow I, okay one thing I do have to say is that the visuals are weird it's not that the CGI is bad, it's just the, the the composition and the cinematography, the choices are just, are weird. You know, they don't feel, they don't feel natural, but they, like, it's, it's, it's like, it's strange. It's, I don't know how to describe it. It kind of feels like CW while also feeling like an elevated, like, movie, you know? It feels, it feels like it's, CW type of like, it feels like the people who designed the visuals for the, C, the, the CW shows like Supergirl, Flash, Arrow, Legends of Tomorrow, all that, but they gave them a lot more money. And so it all looks better, but the the way they approach things is similar, if that makes sense. Um, so that's that on the visuals. I think Supergirl is really exciting. I'm excited to see Kara, um, Sasha Kaye in the role. I think her suit looks super cool and they're doing the storyline from Flashpoint where Superman didn't land in on the on the Kent farm and instead landed like where the government had him and all of that elements. So that's really cool. I am excited to see that. Zod, of course, that's really exciting. And he's saying that we this he's created a world where there's no metahumans. And so I wonder if he's gonna assemble people from throughout the multiverse to fight with him. So far, I think we only have the Batman and the Supergirl along with the Flash. And it seems like there's two Flashes because there's that one part where they run into each other. Uh, so that's interesting. Uh, I there's The Batmans look like, I don't know if there's just one Keaton Batman, but he looks awesome and he moves so well. I bet he's like, there's a lot of CGI like stunt doubles throughout the movie, but him on the bike, like, is that the Nolan Batman? It looks like the Nolan Batman. Like, wow, wow, wow. There's so much to break down in this trailer. So let me know what else you found in the trailer that you thought was interesting and cool um, and what you're looking forward to. And does this trailer do it for you? Does this excite you? Are you interested in seeing this movie in theaters and are you gonna support it? Or does the drama with Ezra Miller, is it just too much for you to get over? What do you think? I think Ezra Miller as Barry Allen is not, doesn't really convince me like that's not what i'm excited about what i'm excited about are like the story elements the plot the powers all of that stuff and so that's what i'm looking forward to i still think he's not like the perfect barry allen slash flash but we'll see i liked him in the snyder cut so we'll see share your thoughts in the comments below thank you so much for watching make sure you like this video and subscribe click that bell icon so you don't miss any upcoming videos and don't forget to share this video with your friends and fellow movie enthusiasts. Lots more Super Bowl trailers coming soon, so stay tuned. I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.